Will here for Crossfire Co op. I'm with Josh, the producer yes. at D3Go. Hi, yeah, I'm the senior producer at D3Go for Marvel Puzzle Quest and Magic the Gathering Puzzle Quest. Uh, both of the games are basically puzzle version RPG games. So, Marvel Puzzle Quest has been around for almost three years. Um, you're matching colored uh, runes uh, or mana to basically uh, bring out the powers of the superheroes that you choose to play as. And in Magic the Gathering, it's basically the same thing, but you're playing with magic cards, and you're matching the mana crystals to bring out and power your creatures to come out and summon and defeat the other planeswalkers. So, um, Marvel Puzzle Quest, like I said, has been out for almost three years. We're having a big anniversary coming in up, up in October. Uh, we just released Wasp, who's a really old, uh, fit, great character. Um, and then we have Black Bolt that's coming this Thursday. And he's super awesome. He's got this thing where he just whispers and takes out the middle part of the board. And then he can power that up and make it a yell, which clears the whole board and destroys the enemy. Um, and then we have, uh, after that, Spider-Woman. Uh, so those are our, our latest characters, of, along with a ton of events and all these other PvP things. Magic, we're, we have Origins all the way through both of the Gatewatch, and we're releasing Shadows Over Innistrad soon. And we're adding an Alliance feature like we have in Marvel Puzzle Quest to Magic together. <laughs> Just the latest cool stuff. I was playing in Marvel probably late 2013, 2014. What's changed since then? Why should I jump back in? Well, we just have, we have five stars, so I don't know if we got to five stars, but five stars are super devastating, more powerful. We just added a new Bruce uh, banner that turns into Hulk as a five star. Um, then we have a bunch of great movie tie-ins, like Civil War is it's coming up again. We did a, something around the movie launch. Um, yeah, we just have a ton of characters and stuff coming out that are newer and better and like really interesting. Like the Bruce Banner one's awesome because he actually transforms from Bruce Banner into the Hulk and then he becomes another power. You know, that's cool. Um, so yeah, everything. All the characters are getting more interesting. Like Black Bolt was kind of hard to program, but he's getting in. He's like really awesome and devastating. So <laughs> yeah, we're, we're adding new features with the characters for now. Um, we're also, you know, working on some more stuff that the community's been asking for for a while. So, you know, people that have gone away because they weren't happy, we're trying to fix some of those situations that we had and just make players, you know, have a lot of fun with the game, you know? Very cool. <laughs> I mean, that's the biggest thing, it's just yeah. getting in and having fun. Yeah, it's really <laughs> yeah. So, anything else you want to mention about Magic? Yeah. Um, Magic, Magic's just, a, it's, it's a great version of the card game. So instead of those land cards, you're doing the mana to get the creatures out. It's a lot of fun um, customizing your deck and, and getting new cards and seeing what's coming next. Like Shadows of Rainer Strat, we're adding, you know, Transform, where you can get the werewolves out and stuff like that and transform your cards around. Um, and we have uh, Madness coming too, which is we discard a card to do extra damage or something. And, just, and we have a ton of Planeswalkers coming. <laughs> Um, some new events where you can earn Planeswalkers. Oh, that's cool. Um, so lots of really great stuff happening in Magic as well. It, it's, it, Gen Con's been great for this because you know, a lot of people get the rules. So it's like they come over and it's like, oh, we got all of this in the game. And they're like super excited about it. So it's been great to see that at Gen Con this year. That's really good because I, don't actually, I haven't actually played Magic myself. But from what I've heard, a lot of games don't get the rules right. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we have gamified the rules, but they are there. We've got Defender, Reach, and Flying, and all that stuff. We have, um, uh, you know, we, we have like Landfall in the game where you match four of a kind, and it brings extra stuff out. So it's, it's really fun. It's just messing around and playing with it. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Any new titles coming out that you can talk about? <laughs> I don't have anything to talk about yet. <laughs> yeah, yeah I'll we'll let you know when that comes out. <laughs> cool. Sounds good. Sounds awesome. good. But yeah, that's awesome. It. It's been fun. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Thanks for, for having us. Yeah. Thanks for the interview. <laughs> Josh, with D3Go. Thank you.